so first up we have the Swamp Dog. This is a Rage and Cajun creation by my partner, Chef Matt Ray. Uh, basically, it is an andouille sausage, which we make in-house, made from pork shoulder, parsley, cayenne, and some other secret ingredients that we can't tell you about. Uh, we case them, smoke them, uh, everything in-house. The only thing we don't make is the bun, and uh, hopefully we'll start baking those next year. We just don't have the facilities yet. Uh, so the Swamp Dog is the andouille sausage in a bun, topped with shrimp etouffee and a Creole remoulade sauce. And don't worry, I'm about to tell you what those both are. So an etouffee is a roux-based sauce. It's very thick. A roux is flour and butter. And then we add tomato and cream and shrimp and green bell peppers, onions, and celery. These three vegetables are called the holy trinity in Cajun and Creole cooking, and you'll find them in almost every dish from that area. So we put the Holy Trinity in, we add some herbs and spices, mix it all up, and the result is a very rich, savory sauce that gets ladled over the dog. Etouffee in French literally means smothered, and so we are smothering the sausage in the sauce. Uh, then on top of that, we have a remoulade. Remoulade is a mayonnaise-based dressing. It also has... Um, Mustard seeds, a little bit of horseradish, some paprika, and once again, I can't give it all away because we don't want anyone to copy us. Uh, but it's delicious and tangy, and it really sets off the zest of the dish. Uh, so we top that with a little bit of parsley for garnish, and that's the Swamp Dog. The next item we have is the Shrimp and Andouille Cheesecake. This is another original recipe made by Matt. It is not a dessert cheesecake, it is a savory cheesecake. The cheesecake is really delicious. It has chunks of our andouille sausage, pieces of shrimp, red and green bell pepper, onion, gouda cheese, and cream cheese consist the, or make the filling. Uh, and then the crust is Parmesan butter. It is savory, it's rich, it's heavy, it's delicious, and it will make you want to eat more as soon as you try it. That's the cheesecake. The crawfish etouffee is crawfish and etouffee, which I've already explained for you on the Swamp Dog. So remember, etouffee means smothered. Crawfish or mud bugs or crayfish or shalong sha, whatever you want to call them, are like miniature freshwater lobsters. They're delicious. And in Chinese cooking, they are often boiled in their shell and then served and the customer can open them up and eat the, the tail meat from the inside. Here at Raging Cajun, we're fat Americans and we believe in letting our customers get to their food as quickly as possible. So we actually take the tail meat out of the shell for you. We then cook it in an etouffee and serve it with white rice. It is absolutely succulent. It's rich, it's creamy, it's savory, and it's one of our best selling items. Not a whole lot more to say about this dish other than you definitely want to buy some. Last but not least, we have the roast beef po' boy. The po' boy sandwich has a long history in New Orleans. Uh, it was originally served to construction workers and other workers who worked outside all day. They didn't make a lot of money. They had to eat quickly. They did not have a lot of ingredients available. So what do you do? You deep fry some shrimp or you cook up some beef or you fry some oysters or some chicken or whatever it is. You slap it on a half loaf of French bread, put some mayonnaise, tomato, and uh, lettuce on there. You've got yourself a delicious sandwich. We try and step it up a little bit here at Rage and Cajun, make it a little bit more tasty and worth your money. So our roast beef po' boy is French bread. We have handmade roast beef by my partner, Chef Matt. He makes some every other day. We chop that up. We let it steam in its own juices inside of our hot well. Cut it up, put it on top of the sandwich. We then have roast beef based gravy that we put on top of the beef. And then we top that with lettuce, tomato, uh, you can add cheese if you want to, and mayonnaise, and serve it in the classic style. Uh, a lot of people like to add uh, shredded cheddar or Swiss cheese. You can do Gouda cheese. You can bring in blue cheese. We don't care. You want cheese, we got cheese. Uh, the sandwich is served with french fries and is hearty, large, and very much worth it.